From the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good afternoon. I'm student meteorologist Dennis Kruloff with your Friday evening CNET forecast. So right now, taking a look at the webcam outside of Beaver Stadium, we have a beautiful blue sky out there with a temperature of 59 degrees and a dew point of 36. So it is feeling a little chilly out there, but anyway, the sun is out, so get outdoors if you can and enjoy that sunshine. Taking a look at temperatures across the entire Commonwealth, not much going on. Temperatures ranging from the low 50s to the mid 60s, depending where you're located. And looking at the current radar and satellite, again, nothing much going on, no clouds and no precipitation in sight. Taking a look at the temperature change over the last 24 hours, we did have a cold front that went through the region last evening, which brought in these cooler temperatures. So it is a little bit cooler than it was compared to yesterday afternoon. Taking a look at the future radar for starting out tomorrow morning through tomorrow afternoon. Again, not much going on, mostly sunny skies across western and eastern portions of the state. We will have some cloud cover that will begin to move into the western portions of the state tomorrow afternoon ahead of our next system, but staying mostly clear here in Center County. However, that will change as we head into Sunday morning. We will see the low pressure system move in, which will provide rain showers here in Center County as soon as 1030 on Sunday. So make sure to bring the rain gear if you're heading out Sunday morning. And then through Sunday, we're going to have scattered showers develop with scattered clouds. So keep the rain gear handy if you're heading out on day on Sunday. And taking a look at the longer range future radar, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, going to have multiple chances of rain showers as a low pressure system north of our region spins in moisture from the Lake Erie, which we'll, we'll see the continued rain showers through the early next week. For tonight, we'll see a temperature of 40 degrees with clear and chilly conditions. Again, we're going to have winds out of the northwest, so it'll be a little chilly. If you're heading out tonight, bring a hoodie, bring a jacket, maybe a winter coat if you feel like it. For tomorrow, we'll see a temperature of 67 degrees with sunny skies. It's going to be very fall-like, a beautiful Saturday for fall-like weather. We're going to have the winds out of the northwest at 5 to 10 miles per hour, which will bring in a little, it's going to feel a little bit chilly if you're out there, but it won't be too bad. And for the game day forecast tomorrow, if you're out tailgating tomorrow morning, we'll have a temperature of 48 degrees, so it'll be chilly and sunny, so bring a hoodie, a jacket, a raincoat if you so desire. For kickoff tomorrow at noon, it's going to be very fall-like with a temperature of 54 degrees, but by fourth quarter, we should have temperatures warming up into the mid-60s, so it's going to be a little bit warmer tomorrow towards the end of the game, so you might want to take off those layers, but you might want to start with those layers to start the game. And again, Penn State is playing Central Michigan tomorrow. And taking a look at the seven-day forecast, again, not really much going on. We will have the low pressure move in Sunday, which will provide in scattered showers. Temperatures will remain into the upper 60s. However, by Monday, we'll see the temperatures start to drop off with a few showers remaining, maybe a few lake effect rain showers. A temperature of 63. If it was a month later or two months later, we would be seeing snow showers, but nope, rain showers for now. And then Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, we'll begin to clear out as the low pressure starts to move out. The temperatures will remain in the lower 60s. And then look at Thursday night, we could have temperatures dipping down into the 30s. And Friday, we'll see the clouds return, but we remain cool. That is your Friday evening CNET forecast. Have a great weekend and weekend.